Hey, it's Lal here, the founder of WP Contentio, and in this video, I'm gonna show you a demonstration of how Contentio works. Now, this video will consist of basic as well as the pro features. However, I will highlight the difference so that you do not get confused. So here we are at the main WP Contentio dashboard, and the first thing after setting up Contentio, you will see is the trending videos on the main homepage which is a great source of uh, to create trending content now if you need uh, to create a content based on some keywords you can just basically put in any keyword in here and it will retrieve videos for you or you can uh, if you have a specific video and you would like to convert that into the subtitles then you can just paste in that URL in here and content you will fetch the details for you so let's start I'm gonna you know let's say go with something like motivational speeches maybe and then I can you know order the video results by relevance or the most recent ones or the most viewed ones right and I could also sort them with the license of creative common which will allow me to use the video without giving attribution to the real owner so here we have a whole lot of videos and uh, you know we can even preview any of it before we actually choose one and um, let's say I'm gonna go with this one right here I'm just gonna give it a second to load all the details now what basically Contentio is doing is that it is fetching YouTube subtitles and converting them into a fully formatted Facebook oh, WordPress post, right? So as you can see right here, here's the entire content fully formatted with paragraphs and all that. And we have the thumbnail right here. I can change the thumbnail from as well from here and i can add it the post tags now these tags are basically uh, fetched from the video tags and converted into post tags this helps get better indexing on search engines and then we have the word count which is about 1500 words for this post and the estimated reading time is about eight minutes right now i can you know make any and all edits i want from right here and uh, I can even you know spin the content to um, you know uh, you know change it to the most exclusive version just give it a second and it will you know spin the content right so now our content has spin as you can see right here we have a pop-up that says the content has been spent and then we have the spin content in front of us right and then uh, I can you know even revert this back to the original content if I want and uh, another thing that uh, we can do is that we can you know change uh, the language of this video let me just you know reset to the original content so now I can you know change the language of this video into literally a hundred and five different languages any of it right so let's say I'm gonna change this into Spanish. I'm just gonna select that language from the language selector and a content here will do the rest of the job for me. And as you can see here we have that whole post converted into Spanish, right? So then uh, I can you know uh, to choose the category I want this video to be posted in now I don't have categories on this blog which is why you don't see any then I can you know uh, change some settings I can either include the video in the post if I want I can uh, you know include the video attribution I can uh, you know publish a post immediately if I want or I can you know publish it as a draft for later on and I can even include the thumbnail in the post if I want but I'm just gonna leave that I can also add a footer link like a call to action at the end of the post so let's say that and uh, this is a motivational video and we would like to pitch a course based on you know mindset and motivation so let's say
and then I'm gonna you know link it to wherever wherever I want it to another thing that as a pro user you will be able to do is that you will be able to syndicate your post on your social media channels right so uh, basically uh, you know you can publish on about 10 15 social media that buffer supports we actually in allow the pro users to integrate with buffer and post to um, their social media channels with buffer in real time now buffer is actually a free service so uh, you know you can check that out as well and uh, you know once i'm satisfied with all of this i can just go ahead and hit the create post button and that's exactly what it's going to do and it will also post the content on uh, on my social media channels right let me just give it a minute and do that so here is our post which is now published right let me just go back to the content your dashboard now and i'm going to show you the pro feature of a scheduler and how you can you know completely auto auto post uh, your blogging right so um, now what scheduler basically does is that it allows you to schedule or drip feed your posts uh, for a particular uh, according to the interval of a particular time period that you define so let's say i want i can even create you know uh, the, the scheduled post can even be created over uh, in 105 languages right as you can see right here so first I will define the language right here and I'm going to go with English for this for demonstration and then I'm going to define the keywords I want the content on right. So let's say I'm going to say social media marketing, content marketing and blogging. Let's say I want uh, videos on these three topics right. I'm going to define the number of posts I want and then I'm going to define the interval time. Or even if I can, you know, uh, post it instantly by defining zero hours and zero minutes interval. And then I can, you know, uh, uh, post it uh, into a category or I can, you know, uh, change all the settings and all that. And then uh, I can um, add a text call to action now. Keep in mind that this scheduling feature is a pro feature, right? So the basic users don't get this. Let me just, you know, um, add something randomly just for this demonstration and hit the generate, spo generate post button right right so here we have um, you know our posts all of them that we created on social media marketing content marketing and blogging and all that right right so um, another thing that I would like to show you is the feature is the you know the different features let me just go to the settings section right here right so you can uh, you know we integrate with usine you can basically um, you know get uh, if you are a usine user then you can uh, add your public key and token in here and integrate with usine and you know replace your thumbnails with with the, your usine images and same can be done with the with Dropmark as well, right? And then we have this special words feature. Now, what this does is that it hyperlinks the words that you define here in your entire blog, right? So let's say if I type in money in here, and if it is to be found anywhere in my blog, it will be replaced with the link I define here, right? This is also a pretty cool feature which allows you to, you know, monetize different keywords of your of your website, right? So yeah, that's pretty much how WP Contentio works and I hope that you like this demonstration. If you would like to see the demo blog, you can go to demo.wpcontentio.com. Let me just show you the demo blog and as you can see right here. Right, so uh, here is blog and you know, uh, it also contains the post that we just created the motivation one and the content marketing and blogging etc right so um, yeah that's pretty much how WP Contentia works and I hope that you like this demonstration so thank you